40, verses 3, 4, and 5. The voice of him that cries in the wilderness, repair ye the way of the Lord. Make straight in the desert a highway for our God. Every valley shall be exalted, and every mountain and hill shall be made low. And the crooked shall be made straight, and the rough places plain. And the glory of the Lord shall be revealed. That means that in your life, whatever will bring glory to God will be revealed in Jesus' name. The Lord wants to come, and the way he wants to take to come will prepare that way. So that there will be no hindrance at all for the outpouring of the Spirit of God, of the power of God, of the blessings He wants to give us. Exodus 15 verse 2. The Lord is my strength and my song. He has become my salvation. He is my God and I will prepare Him an habitation. My Father's God, I will exalt Him. You see the preparation there? I'll prepare Him a habitation. Some qualities of the eyes that the Lord is saying, get these qualities in your preparation. Everything that you're doing. Make sure that you're like these ants. And I'm using those uh, letters for the name ants, A-N-T-S. A, activity with initiative. Activity with initiative. You've never seen any ant just standing, staying idle, not doing anything. It's activity. They're always active, always active. They're taking this, they're taking this. Although their sizes are very small, they're, they unite together and they're very, very active and they take initiative. Nobody has to say, put this one here, put this one there. Activity with initiative. N, networking with interest networking you'll not see them just walking together if somebody is carrying so one of those ants carrying something another one comes another one comes and by the time you you know turn aside to see they're networking already and they do it with interest they do it to joy excitement that's what the lord is telling you know, us say go and learn from the ants the tea there's tenacity in industry Tenacity in industry, they never give up. We're not going to give up. A kind of publicity this time is not just a local scene, a private scene that only people in one street corner there will hear. Everyone this time, they will know something is going to happen. It is not to hide ourselves and just whisper to each other. It says, we're going to place this one abroad until everyone will hear. Everyone in our world, everyone in our community, they were here. The Lord gave the word, and great was the company of those that published it. That word publish is the same as publicize. And it says he wants everybody to publicize that and tell everyone around that this is what the Lord wants to do. No local government was left out, and no province was left out. And there's no division that was left out. There's no area community was left out. They all came from every quarter, and that's what we are going to do. And this time, we're going to use all methods applicable. By boss, commercial bosses are there. You get in there, and you announce, you publicize, you proclaim that retreat, and then you give the hand base in that retreat. You follow the rules of all those bosses. On the radio, they are hearing. Television, they are hearing. Everywhere, they are hearing. By the time we get there, even before we get there, miracles will be happening. You are going to see something when you come to this retreat. You'll see blind eyes open. You'll see the lame rising up and walking. You'll see the deaf here and you see many miracles God is going to perform in Jesus name you are going to see lives transformed you are going to see believers strengthened energized and revived and you are going to see the mighty outpouring of the spirit of God upon sanctified believers in Jesus name be glad and rejoice for the Lord will do great things for the Lord will do great things for the Lord will do great things the time has arrived. Are you ready? I said, are you ready? Ready and sitting down. Are you ready? Are you ready? Why don't you tell the Lord, oh Lord, I want to see. Oh Lord, I want to see. Oh Lord, I want to be part of that. I'm going to be part of that. Your family will be part of that. Your children will be part of that. Husband, wives will be part of that. All the whole church, I invite you. We're going to be part of this. The Lord is saying, he is ready now. And he wants to pour out his abundance upon his people.